This is a special report from About Space Today. From Florida's Kennedy Space Center is Don Meyer. NASA and SpaceX are gearing up for the first NASA-certified, commercially-run operational mission to the International Space Station, dubbed Crew-1. Crew-1 astronauts will be following the Demo-2 test flight that launched May 30th and splashed down August 2nd. NASA astronaut Michael Hopkins is the commander of SpaceX's Crew-1 mission and is joined by three crewmates, Victor Glover and Shannon Walker of NASA, and Suichi Noguchi of the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency. In a recent press briefing, the crew revealed the call sign that they chose for their capsule. They said that they looked to the present, rather than the past or the future, to select the name for their spacecraft. The name, Hopkins explained at the briefing, reflected the challenges that the current year has brought forth, not just for his crew or the teams at SpaceX and NASA, but for the entire country and the world. Hopkins explained the name that the crew chose, as well as the significance of their mission patch. Uh, As most of you are probably aware, shortly after getting on orbit for the DM-2 mission, uh, Doug and Bob um, announced the name of their vehicle, Endeavor. And so we think that's a, a great tradition, and we're, uh, we're excited about the opportunity to name our vehicle. However, uh, rather than wait until we got on orbit, we thought we would share that with you today. Uh, so without further ado, the, the Crew-1 Dragon capsule number 207 will henceforth be known by the call sign Resilience. Uh, so as you look at the definition of, of Resilience, uh, you know, that means uh, functioning well in, in times of stress or overcoming adverse events. And, and so I think all of us can agree that 2020 has certainly been a, a challenging year. Uh, global pandemic, economic hardships, um, civil unrest, isolation. And despite all of that, uh, SpaceX, NASA has kept the production line open and finished this amazing vehicle that's getting ready to go on its maiden flight uh, to the International Space Station. And so the name Resilience is, is really in honor of uh, the SpaceX and, and the NASA teams. And, and quite frankly, it's in honor of our families, of our colleagues, of our fellow citizens, of uh, our international partners and our leaders that have all uh, shown that same, that same quality, that same characteristics uh, through these difficult times. Uh, if, if you look at our patch, you'll notice that um, on the border there's no names, there's no flags, and, and that was by design because that patch, it doesn't just represent the four of us, but it, it really represents the countless people that have contributed to, to getting the vehicle ready and, and getting us ready for this mission. And so uh, the, that same theme applies to the, the name of this vehicle, Resilience. Um, it is not just a connection to, for the four of us, but we really feel like it is a, a connection to all of you, to everybody. Uh, we hope that uh, it brings a smile to your face. It hope, we hope that it uh, uh, provides something positive in your lives. And, and quite frankly, we hope that it's an inspiration um, that, uh, that it shows uh, when you work together, uh, there's no limit to what you can achieve. With resilience, the Crew-1 astronauts, SpaceX, NASA, America and the world move forward into a new age of commercial spaceflight and cooperation. From the Kennedy Space Center on Florida's Space Coast, this is Don Meyer for About Space Today. This has been a special report from About Space Today.